In this video, I'd like to explain why the method of the parallelogram method of adding vectors is equivalent to the algebraic definition of adding vectors. So, as a little bit of a setup here, uh, we have a vector u right here, a vector v in this direction, and then using the parallelogram method of addition, we would get that the uh, sum is u plus v. Equivalently, down here, uh, if we call the coordinates of u, s, and t, and the coordinates of v, a, and b, then the sum would just be s plus a and t plus b, or the coordinates would be s plus a and t plus b. So why, why does that work? All right, so let's uh, take a closer look at this. We have that the coordinates of u were s and t. So that means that the this is s and that this height is t. And then for v, we have uh, that the this coordinate was a and this coordinate was b. The y coordinate was b. Okay. Now if we draw a parallel line uh, through the, the end of v, like so, um, a line, a line parallel to uh, to u, then uh, we have from geometry here we have a couple of interesting uh, <clears throat> happenings here. So first of all, uh, if I draw another parallel line along this direction, I'm just drawing some shapes. Okay, if we look here at this triangle, uh, this triangle right here, and compare it to this triangle here, we can see that uh, this angle is equivalent to this angle because those lines are uh, parallels cut by a transversal. Um, uh, well, actually, you have to skip a step here. It would be, but you can get there very simply. And then also, this is a right angle, as is this a right angle. And um, uh, so these triangles are similar. And if we cut this triangle off so that this side and this side is congruent, um, then this is also S, and then this is also T. Okay, so now if we look at what are the coordinates of u plus v, well, the coordinates of u plus v, oops, okay, the coordinates of u plus v, let's use a different color here. Go all the way over and up. Well, here I have... Uh, a, and then along here I have S, so that means that the rest of this is S, which means that the x-coordinate of u plus v is A plus S, and similarly here we have that this is B, and this is T, so we have that that is T plus B. So that shows that uh, the coordinates of u plus v are uh, a plus s, or s plus a, right here along this side, and t plus b on this side. So the parallelogram method of, uh, of adding vectors gives us an equivalent, the parallelogram method of adding vectors gives us an equivalent algebraic definition of adding vectors, and they are the same.